a team you can trust. Big O Tires. I'd like to ask you, how many of you people have smartphones? Smartphones? They have cameras on them, don't they? Yeah. Okay, we're going to conduct a quick drill. Uh, I'd like you to, uh, when I say go, pull out your smartphone and take a picture of the people at your table or whatever, and uh, this is just to get you so that you can take a quick picture. I'm just um, representing the Sheriff's Auxiliary in the uh, Pahrump Neighborhood Watch Program. And basically what I'm trying to do is get people to look after one another. And that seems to be working pretty well. We started a Facebook site, oh, about a year, year and a half ago, about, um, with 200 people called the Pahrump Neighborhood Watch in here, in, in Facebook. And uh, out, we're over 1,200 members now. It's and going strong. 1,200 members valley-wide that are keeping an eye on what's going on. Uh -huh. you know and, and trying to watch after their neighbor it's a good site to join um, it's a closed group so you just need to um, send in um, to get approved to join the group search Pahrump neighborhood watch and then put in a request and then we just go ahead and put it on there and then you're in and so if you see something exciting out of wreck or things like that that people should know or dogs running wild anything then you post it on Pahrump neighborhood watch site and 1200 people get it instantaneously. One of the things that you were telling the seniors today is how to, I'm um, talking to them about how to use their smartphone. If they see something that they're concerned about, take a picture of it and you can talk to a sheriff, you can talk to the Neighborhood Watch, you can you post can it. You can post it on the site, uh, Neighborhood Watch site, and that gives everybody a view of it. The Neighborhood Watch site is kind of in lieu of having groups around town. True. We, you know, I don't mind coming, anybody that wants to put together two or three people and have a, a neighborhood watch meeting I'll come over and give them a spill we'll go through the drill of pulling out their cell phones and taking a quick picture and you know that's just practice well, they still put up signs around town for the neighborhood. right we still have some signs that can go up uh, I've only got a few left uh, I think I've got two but that's okay anybody that requests a sign I can't say whether they're a deterrent or not but I I believe that they work and it's important just to keep an eye on what's going around sure. your it's a reminder of people in that area keep an eye out on what's going on for more information how can they contact you it's 775-727-9823 uh,